folks, and welcome to this premium analysis of the S&P 500. Excuse me. Um, okay, so looking here, I mean, we had a, a really nice reaction at this buy zone just here. Okay, tested once, tested twice, and a lovely reaction on the third time. So we got pretty far deep um, into this price inefficiency. So I think we could debate that we have returned to the origin the low edge of it. Okay, so we reference that price tested and now we're moving lower. So what's price going to do now? Well, I'm guessing we're going to revisit these lows here. So having a look on the on the daily chart, see what that looks like. <clears throat> you can see that. Yeah, I mean, we got pretty close to the highs. Let's have a look here. So we had this little price structure here. There's a buy zone right there. Went really deep into it. Tested the edge. We had a visit Right, the sell zone was right there. We got pretty close to it, and now we're starting to move lower. And so we have something in here as well. Tested once, twice, <clears throat> removed by something in here. So we'll just mark that off. It looks like that. The buy zone established here, so we're probably going to continue to move down to here. I'm um, not sure what's going to happen once we get there, but we do have a price inefficiency in here as well, and also at these lows here. So price could easily um, uh, move through this and then move back up and re-reference the area of supply that removed it and then continue down but we have to wait to see what this price nodule looks like as it approaches this area here and if it is able to remove it so we have to wait for the time being if we go down to the four hour chart and see what's cooking on the small time frame um, okay we can see here we had this little price nodule tested once removed this is the one we saw on the other time frame nicely there so we'll probably have a bounce there we also have a price inefficiency so price is likely gonna move down to here and then have a bounce and then move up depending on what price does once it gets down here if it moves down here like this and then it sits on this area here and starts to paint white candles um, that I'm guessing it's gonna have a, a cut through and then revisiting the area before continuing down to this buy zone which is a little lower Okay, so there are a couple of scenarios here we can keep our eyes open, so watch those. And if you have any questions, please let me know. Thanks for watching.